it over the plate. He's going to dominate. Swing and a miss. A 93 mile an hour changeup at some people's fastball. Swing and a miss. Second strikeout for Heal. Another scoreless inning. No runs, no hits, no errors. One man left. We go to the bottom of the second. And he's getting there. The batting average now at 230. High fly ball, right field and deep. Going back, Kepler on the track at the wall. See ya! Off the top of the wall and rolls in. One nothing Yanks. First pitch swinging. A little cutter out over. And just enough off of the glove of Kepler. Off of the top of the wall and gone. All three games of the series. Did he go? Yes, he did. Castro down on strike. Strikeout number three for Heal. You can throw 97, 98 and just overpower hitters up in the strike zone. If you're Luis Heal. We've seen a lot of change ups in this game early. Heal deals. Strike three. Correa down looking. No runs you hit, no errors, one man left. We go to the bottom of the third, it's one nothing Yanks. And the tall right-hander deals. Punched in the right field, that is going to be a base hit. And it's going to roll into the corner. Scoring is LeMayu. Here comes Volpe. He'll score. It's a two-run double for Judge. And the Yankees lead 3-0. Judge hardest hit this year, but he will take it right off the end of the bat. The question was, would it stay fair? And it does. And you could tell that Kepler is going to have trouble with this right from the beginning. LeMayu scores easily. Volpe with his speed. He's going to score from first. You see Kepler has a little bit of trouble. 2-2. Swing and a miss. Got him. Strikeout number five. No runs, no hits, no errors. And one man left. We go to the bottom of the fourth. But old school would be establish your fastball. This could be two. That conversation worked, John. 5-4-3. Five, five shutout innings for Luis Hill. At the end of four and a half, halfway through, 3 nothing Yanks. Strike three. Fastball on the outside corner. Correa down looking. He struck out three times. And he's going to realize that when he pitches to the scoreboard, a 3 nothing lead, here's my best fastball. When it's located like that, there's nobody in the league that's going to be able to do anything, even if he misses out over the plate. Royce Lewis walked twice against Hill. Ooh. And you gave that stat, and that is a jinx, a stat jinx. As the scoreless streak ends on the Royce Lewis home run, and it's 3-1, the Yankees. Drill deep to left field. There it goes. See ya. Into the second deck. A two-run blast by Stanton, and the Yankees lead 5-1. Curveball that just moves middle, down, and in. Another look from the side, just such a simple little stride. Soto and Judge are getting all the attention, but Stanton having a very solid beginning to his season. Well, this should do it. Fly ball to left field. Verdugo is there. And the Yankees win their sixth in a row. They beat the Twins 5-1. to one. Another great performance by Hill. A home run by Giancarlo Sin. A couple of ribbies for Aaron Judge. And they just keep rolling along, John. Yeah, I think you just said it perfectly. A great road trip, 7-2 and two out on the West Coast. And then you come back and just dominate this Twins lineup. Only two hits. One run, five runs, enough on the board. A lot for the manager, Aaron Boone, to like. Giancarlo Stanton, his 15th of the year.